down a little bit. Maybe music down a little more. And voice down a bit. Okay. Feels pretty fluid so far. Turn back. Oh, what are what's on my hotkeys here? Lightning blast. Oh, so is it like, let me see. Do I target like here? Okay, so I have to actually like aim at the guy. That's good. Feels auto target, man. <laughs> oh. It says it's AoE. I think it said it's AoE. Okay. Ooh. Let me see this. I don't want whites. A heater shield? Okay, so that's auto equipped. This is melee fire and spell fire. Chance to slow. Mana plus three. Can we go inside here, maybe? There you go. It's EHG Mitch and uh, Eki Marcher. Um, the Discord for the demo download. Unfortunately, I have links disabled right now because uh, it's like kind of fucked, but you can whisper anyone you'd like. I have to mess around my Twitch settings. I apologize. Oh, you can block spells. Okay. What is this? Is this... Oh, this is left click for move and right click for attack. So am I ranged? Because I'm a... No, 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 no. So staff is melee. Summons ancestral ghosts. Periodically becomes rampant. Oh, like that? <laughs> like that? <laughs> Please no, senpai. Don't touch me. My face cam is over it. Wait, am I blocking some? Oh, my blocking. I'm blocking the pre-alpha. Give me a sec. I'll put a. I'll put a text. I'll make a text. Give me a second. Um. Text properties. This is currently a pre-alpha. Can I can I do that? Is that is that okay if I put it like that? I don't think I was supposed to space it. Hold on, the spaces look a bit weird. Dude, it's so I know this is going to sound like a weird thing to say, but it's really smooth to alt tab out of the game and I genuinely am very happy about that as a as a Twitch streamer for making mistakes like this or just not being fully prepared. New skill unlocked, Elemental Nova. Whoa, I just got a skill? Hold on. Fuck that Iron Axe. Are there any, like, breakable debris? No. Okay. Cast a Nova around you that deals fire, cold, and lightning damage. And it's tagged as Spell, AoE, Elemental, Cold, Fire, Lightning. That's pretty cool. It's, like, similar to tags as well. Let me just see. How does this work? It's pretty flashy, dude. I like that. That's pretty okay. Not too bad, dude. That's like kind of OP, dude. All right, clear speed meta has arrived. Yeah, dude, elemental hit Nova. That's pretty cool. Spell damage? Whoa, whoa, gimme. This is a branch. Oh, this is a branch too. You have reached level 3, Mana Strike. Alright, this is for melee. A melee attack that hits all enemies in an area in front of you, dealing 10 additional lightning damage and returning mana to you for each enemy hit applies added damage at half effectiveness. Feels elemental attack speed builds, man. <laughs> elemental hit is now a Nova. This is a buff. That's correct. <laughs> Yeah, it loads. Oh, a tome? Okay, hold on. Let's let's see. Let's see some mana strike here. 
We're gonna do a one, two. I'm scared. Those guys are spooky. Hold on, we'll go back in a sec. That's a sash. Sash gives agility. Can I see what stats do? More stats. Will it show it? Okay. Uh, so adds 100 armor, increased melee damage by 20%. So this is just telling me what I currently gain from my stats. So this would be, is this like your base here? My base would be like 100 armor and just standard 20%. Reduces, or is this per point? Is that how impactful stats are? That one stat gives you 20% melee physical? I guess it's an increase, not a like a multiplier though. Tells you what you get per point. Okay, it's per point. So stats are really strong. One point of agility gives you 3% attack and cast... Wait, 3% movement speed and 6% attack and cast speed? That's awesome. I love when games use like small numerics because I'm a big fan of like mental math. <laughs> so like it just makes it really easy to see it like that. Endurance adds 150 tenacity, reducing chance to be stunned and elemental protection. Cool. So in oh, so finally a game that doesn't attach like magic resistance to like intelligence or wisdom. Reduces ward decay rate. I don't know what that is. Increases elemental damage by 20%? Ooh, man. Block chance. Do we know how much block we block? Like is block 100% block? Or is it uh, by amount? Dodge chance, you have your fire. Protects against fire damage, so proportion reduced is equal to... Okay, got it. And then you have your attack speed, cast speed, crit chance, crit multi, fire, cold, lightning, physical, void, holy, minion damage, spell damage, ward retention, which I don't know yet, but it's something with intelligence. The ES equivalent. Ward is an overshield that you can gain through skills in combat and decays over time. It has no maximum. <laughs> Alright, let's do it! I'm excited, dude. I know this is only like really, really early on, but I'm getting excited, dude. I like seeing customization and scaling in games. Okay. Wait, wait, didn't I just get a tome? Oh, a tome is like here. Okay, I'm used to tomes being like in uh, shield spots. Block reduces damage like armor does. Your shield displays how much armor it gives. Okay. I, mean, I can pick this up for now, but I don't really need it. Alright, can I go inside here? Can I look... Oh, by the way, do you want me to... How is the, uh, the audio for the... Am I stunned? There we go. How is the audio for the, like, um, music? I can turn it up if I need to. New specialization slot? Shit is going down! Hold on a second. Fire shield surrounds you with a protective shield for 14 seconds that grants 100 armor, elemental protection, and retaliation. Wait, retaliates with a fireball when you take 35 damage? Looks pretty clean, dude. I'm pretty happy with that. Oh! Skill system introduction. Welcome to the skill system. Click on a skill icon to view its augment tree. To use a new skill, drag an icon from the skill panel to the action bar located in the lower left of the screen. You can specialize in up to five skills by clicking on an unlocked specialization slot located above which unlocks as you level up. Specializing in a skill will allow you to gain skill points for that skill by earning experience with it, which you can use to empower and augment it. Note, some skills do not have an augmented tree available yet. Okay, so far our favorite skill has been Elemental Nova for sure. So, so it's got a skill tree. I saw a little bit of this. Okay, um, now is there a limit or can I, can I realistically acquire everything yet? Like, I mean, not yet, but you know, like in the future, is there going to be like, like how does... What, what is your design goal for this out of curiosity? Is it going to be like you could respec in town for a cost? Is it like Diablo 2 style, very limited with your respecs? Um, you have a max of 20 points to put in this tree. Okay, so that's like, I gotcha, 20 points. You will never be able to max this out. Good, all right. And you can specialize up to five at a time. So you get five at a time and you can specialize. I guess that would be the term specialize, not complete, right? So that's good. Respects will not be as easy to do as Diablo 3. We want them to feel impactful. Okay, cool. 
You can respec whenever you want, but you have to start leveling up from scratch. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Okay. I see. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right. Enables Lightning Nova. Oh, I can make it a certain element. Oh, wait. Wait, what? Hold on. Enables Lightning Nova. Nova has an equal chance to cast each Nova type you have enabled. Whoa. Nova has an equal chance to cast each Nova type you have. And I don't understand that wording. Survival of the... That's nuts. Critical strike chance per point. I can just look at all the other ones, though. It's fine. Gain additional 8% of your life as ward when you gain ward from survival of victor. This is like defenses. Enables fire nova. Okay, fire nova. Nova ignites on hit, but has a 4 second cooldown. Increase cooldown recovery speed per point. 50 critical strike multiply... Nerf! I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> if you pick Fire Nova, then it's only, well, then it's always Fire Nova. If you do Fire and Ice, then it's 50. Oh, so you're saying if you split the elements. Okay, got it, got it. That makes sense. You can target your no. Ooh, ooh, I think I'm getting this. I think I. This looks OP. This looks OP. Okay, enables Ice Nova. 25% chance to chill per point. Dude. Chance per point to create chain reaction of lesser Nova? So what if you do arcane projection? Hold on. If I have arcane projection and it rolls an ice Nova, does that mean that I still pick where the ice Nova goes? And if it rolls ice Nova, because it would be 50-50 between ice and fire, it has a chance of spreading frost well, this would be, I don't know what it goes to, but I can multicast, not multicast, but this would work on this. Yes? Oh! Okay, what does this do? Base damage? All right. Chance per point to gain 10% of your maximum life as ward on hit. Increase ward gain. It's time, boy. Okay, do I have any points? I don't have any points yet. I want to level. I'm grinding. I don't care if it's alpha. I'm going to go grind. Let's go. Ancient Tome, 15 mana, okay. Is this a waypoint? This is... <laughs> I wanna go grind, boys, let's go. Oh wait, I learned new skills too. I don't even have like, Fireball, Glacier, Ice Ward, Meteor, Teleport! This one, I want it. 42 mana cost, Static Orb, Innervate, Grants 50% of your health as ward. Grants 100% increased mana efficiency for 4 seconds. <laughs> you have to press specialization button to take your first point. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, select the skill. Um, elemental Nova. Click. Fire Nova. Zero unspent points. Good. Got it. Let me just make sure. That's fire now. So how can I see the XP? Will it show it like... I guess I'll check there in a second and see if it shows it. Oh my. Boys, we're getting bullied. Team! Senpai, no! Don't hurt me! Bad. Bad defiler. Battery low indeed. I'm scared. Who's that? Who's that? Please, no. I looked like the elders attack. <laughs> So can I see the progress of the skill anyway? Like, can I see it's de-specialize? I see. As you level up, you'll unlock five specialization slots. Each one can be used to specialize in a skill. Okay. Um, that's what we just said. And then skills gain experience when you do. And when a skill levels up, you gain a point. Press E to drink a potion. Oh, E is the... I see it right here. E. Okay, thank you. I like the music a lot, actually. I, I think I'm going to turn it up a bit. Let me plug this headset in, though. It said, battery low. Oops. Charging battery. What happened? Where'd it go? My audio turned off. 
<laughs> I... Can you guys hear? Am I... Did I... My headset turned off. What? <laughs> How did that happen? Mic off. Link established. Mic off. What? Mic off. Mic on. Mic off. I don't think my Corsair headset likes this game. <laughs> my headset's having a little malfunction. <laughs> Link established. I haven't heard Link established before. That's a new one. Oh, can I talk to this NPC? I guess not, not yet, maybe. Let me just let me press a couple more buttons here, make sure. Is there like a talk option? Wait, passive grid? What is this? When you reach level five, you will unlock the passive grid. Use access points to travel down paths, increasing your character's power and unlocking passive nodes. Use nodes on passive nodes. Use node points on passive nodes you have unlocked to gain powerful augmentations. Axis of warning, axis of combat, axis of wisdom, axis of destruction. Is this is this per class or is this global for everyone? Quest and talking to NPCs is disabled in this build. Okay, no, that's fine. That's per class. Oh, so each class is unique to itself? Do does do any classes share anything specifically? Like, do they share skills or anything, or are they all pretty unique? Look at the names. Well, I know it looked different specifically, but I'd just rather ask them. There's no need to, like, speculate when you have developers, right? Summons a twin at half health. We're level five! Let's go, boys! Unallocated skill points. Okay. Okay. We said we want to get Arcane Projection. So do I have to level this up? Five points to get here? Okay. Increased cast speed and crit chance per point. Adds three health per point. Adds one intelligence every three points. Adds three health per point. We have our five base classes, then each class has two subclasses. The subclasses will share with their master class. But each five base class will have their own grid. Okay, good. Base classes will have eight skills that are shared between their mastery. For example, Druid and Beastmaster will both get swipe from their base primalist. Okay. So how do we want to do this then? Let's see. Um... Elementalist. Oh! Battle Mage, Elementalist, Scholar, and then Warder. So, I guess we just, we want to look at what section we want, right? So we're on fire, right? We're going to be fire and ice, but mainly fire right now. 10% damage to mana. Mana armor? Mana regen per point. Increased mana per point. Cast speed per point and 15 mana. Critical strike chance with lightning skills. Increased stun chance with cold skills? <laughs> Dude, that'd be OP! Void barrier grants 20 times your agility as ward. Attack CI builds, boys! Dexterity increases dot. You can change how skills scale, too. All right, you know what we're gonna do? If I put a point here, how, oh wait, how do I, requires node points. Okay, let me let me see how this works then, sorry. How do I unlock this? If I put a point here, what happens to it? Oh, can I remove that? I'm just kidding. No, 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 how did, can I remove it? <laughs> so, so, whoopsies, is, is there a remove button, reset? <laughs> Oh, 
I mean, Arcane Furnace sounds really mad, too. No respect for passives. Okay, that's fine. Oh, I can get this now, though. Here we go. And I have one of those points. Okay. No, no, it's it's okay. It's an alpha, like a pre-alpha. Sorry, I don't mind. Okay, so this is good. I'll just leave it like this then. I guess I guess I'm gonna go down Axis of Destruction now. Oh, so wait, as you put in more points, is this how it works? As you put in more points, this this part like stretches to show like where your strengths are, and if the light touches, you have access to it. Is that how it works? Ah, that's a smart system. Chance to poison on hit. Minion physical damage? Can you zoom out the minimap? I'm guessing that'll be a future. It is a- it is a big shield. Wait, why didn't I pick up that other shield? Oh, I thought I was using- I thought I was using, like, a tome, and then I realized tome is not the same thing as what it usually is. Okay, um, that's better than this one. I guess I can go back and get that shield really fast. Well, it's- no, we did it. Tenacity plus seven. Can I make an odd suggestion? Uh, in the future, do you plan on making a little noise when you like switch pieces? Can I adjust the difficulty? Oh, can I do that right now? How do I, let me get this waypoint. Maybe it's going to be in character selection. Inventory sounds are coming soon. Okay, cool. Mini K. I have two mini Ks. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh Did I go back to the beginning? That's okay. Oh, you can just click the waypoint. Difficulty may change in the fly in the settings. Wait, on the fly? Oh, gameplay. Oh. Veteran. No, let's play Masochist. This is fun, right? Is that it? Just boom, done, changed? Is there like... So what's the benefit for playing on another... Like a higher difficulty? Is it more XP? Okay, they do a lot more... Okay! 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 Hey, 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 buddy. Team! 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 Oh! Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh, save me! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. 
<laughs> Alright, let's take this. Let's take this easy, boys. <laughs> okay. This, this is good. Ooh. What? What? This looks OP, dude. Wait, that was like the newbie zone? Oh my. No. 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 Dude, they have, they're like volatile on death, man. That's OP. Movement speed? Oh, they already have movement speed. That's just lightning res now. Okay. Wait, wasn't I higher level? Did I go down in XP? Oh my. Oh my. No, 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 no. Stop it. Flask refill rate? I want it. Actually, I don't want it. I need it. There's a big difference. Okay, I need to start using this shield like every pull. Uh... Sniped, boys. Wait, they're homing? <laughs> go away, go away, stop! Um... Um... <laughs> Go away from me, dude. That's not nice. You're gonna have to stop that now. I can't tank, boys! I can't tank anymore! Go away! Oh. <laughs> They're so mad! They're so mad! Mana and health? Gimme. Where's this new shield? Oops. Can I like put my lightning on right click? I can, right? Okay, cool. He's in charge of balancing. Dude, it's fun so far. Oh, new skills unlocked. Okay, now. That's where the skill level up button will appear. I can see behind all my stuff. Yeah, like I can see my own screen. So we're gonna do one spent access point. So access would go into here. So where where do we wanna go next? Let's look here. Let's, let's go to... Um, I was putting a point here, right? Because I wanted... I mean, cast speed per point is pretty crazy in my opinion. Like, all of this is... like It's all so good. <laughs> Do we have anything else? We level... Okay, this one leveled up here. Nova ignites on hit. No, sorry. We're going... We want... We want arcane... This one here. I want arcane yum yum. And we do have fireball. I'll put this guy right here. Fireball may be like our new spam. Cost is two. See how much it does then. That was a ton of XP. And to be very enticing to go everywhere, it's about being strategic on which nodes are best. Gotcha. Uh, you know what I know is best is not to go down there right now. Okay. 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 Okay, buddy. A helmet! We're getting geared. What's this helmet do? 15 armor. Does armor... Okay, it's... it's Protects against physical damage. The proportion 
Reduced is equal to armor. Oh, it's in... Wait, health gives, like, mitigation too? I'm really bad at understanding formulas. <laughs> Oops. Wait, seven movement speed? Sorry, lightning protection. Are these the volatile? Yeah, these are the volatiles. Please, no, senpai! Deeps! Okay. 20 armor versus... No. What's the current max level? Is it like 10, 15, 20? Around there? Enrages at half HP. Wait, have I even... I don't do any damage to this guy! The current max level is 100? Oh. How much, how much content is there to get to what level then? Maybe it's a better question to ask. Around level 22. Okay. Oh! No, 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 no! Team, can I log? Okay, okay. Aha! I was, I was gonna go for the log out. <laughs> Next area, boys. <laughs> boss zero items. That was like a white mob. That wasn't a boss, dude. Maybe not a white mob, but... Your son will give me god mode cheats after? Thank you. Oh, it was a blue mob. Okay. What was that? Um. Um. Mr. No! No! Okay, here's where... Oh! 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 Deeps! 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 Okay. New skill unlock. Oh, we got a ring. Health gained on potion use. A burning branch. Why does it give... But it gives the wrong kind of damage. It's void and lightning. Okay. Uh, Glacier. Creates three successfully large ice explosions in the target direction. All right, let's put this like where Mana Strike is. Um, did this one level up? No, not yet. We do have another point of Axis. I'm just gonna take the cast speed right now. I think that 10 cast speed. Oh, requires node points, that's right. I'm just gonna keep going. Hold on, let me see where else we wanna go then. What's our next destination to branch to? I'm not doing lightning right now. This is fire damage, which I very well may end up doing fire damage. Stun chance on, on cold skills sounds really good, but we're not cold yet. So where do we go? 
damage dealt to mana before health doesn't seem bad at all. Like, that actually doesn't seem that bad. Go deep? Dude, if I'm going deep, I'm probably going for Arcane Furnace, but this is strength, and I don't think I want strength. What does strength give me? It's melee damage, right? I mean, it's 100 armor. I guess that's okay. What's my current armor? Shit. So I guess it's not bad. Maybe? I'm used to always going deep, so that's why. Let's see. 20% chance to gain 20% of your maximum life as ward on kill. It says it gives HP and MP. No, well, it does too. It adds one strength every five points, adds four health and mana per point. This is insane, though. Right here, intel per point. And this is crit chance, though. Cast speed. And, what is cast speed? Let me let me just check to see. It's so hard to decide what to go to. Fuck, I like it. I like it when it's not just so fucking linear. They're all so good. Like this is insane too. This knowledge buff here. But this, these are, the middle ones are harder to get than the side ones, right? Because you have to, like, distribute quite a few points, I think. Or maybe not. Okay, we're going to do this. We're going to make our decision, like, right now. Here we go. We're making our decision. We're going, we're going strength, boys. We're going to try it. <clears throat> There's just so much I want to try. <laughs> like... No. Um, um. Um, I'll fucking glacier you. You want to fight? So that's like kind of melee. Um, you want to fight? Oh, that's that's like glacial cascade. Hey, oh, you know that fucking destroys your mana pool though, and that guy is really mad. Uh, he has blink too. Uh, excuse me, sir. Would you like to get glacial cascaded in the face? Because it's gonna happen in about three. Two, Glacial Cascade. That feel when Glacial Cascade isn't enough to kill him? Um, regen, how I love you so much. Look at his regen! Heals when not taking damage? Oh my god. Um, I don't know if I can fight this guy. Deeps. Okay, 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 okay. We got, we got him, dude. Want to buy mana strike? But if I mana strike him, he's gonna kill me, dude. But I guess I could try mana strike, but I don't have space for him right now. I'll drop fireball and put mana strike here. Yeah, it wasn't that bad. I just, you're right. I just had to periodically do some damage. No! Feels deeps, man! Shattering stone? Press F to open the crafting panel to use this item. Destroys an item giving you a random number of shards containing power for, or powers from the destroyed item. Oops. So I can place an item in the crafting slot and shatter in a shattering stone or affix shard. Your effective, wait, your effect health against physical armor is the total of your health plus armor. Also, it's how it works for all the protections. Okay. Where did you come from? I don't always read stuff, but if it's an alpha, I try my best. 
Okay. I'm used to dragging items, but click is fine. I'm, I don't know what's higher tier. I'm guessing it goes white, yellow, green, teal, maybe? Let's just try this. And then I'm going to use a shattering stone. And then I'm going to shatter it. I saw it said T1 there. Increase lightning damage. And then what that means is technically I could put this here. And I could put this here. And I could increase the lightning damage of this weapon. Just, just to see because I'm curious. I just want to see. Blue, green, yellow. It goes blue into green. Oh. Blue, green, yellow. Blue green yellow okay got it t5 is the highest t1 is the lowest okay so let me just see this just to be curious so it added it actually added a, like an affix that's really cool uh that might kill me glitch cascade oh i'm potting Boys, we're, we're gonna go farm some XP in this other area. <laughs> right here, boys. <laughs> let's let's go. Come here. Mercenary helmet of the moose. Spell damage and dodge on a helmet? Uh, oh, oh, oh my. Veteran difficulty? Uh, I guess, I mean, we could tone down the difficulty a little bit to explore some content. That's fair enough. Uh, oh my. Fuck it, I couldn't. I was getting stunned. I was getting interrupted. We'll turn down the difficulty a little bit. <laughs> we'll go veteran mode. Let's go. We want to explore the game. We will have a hardcore mode. We'll also have offline single player and server side hosting online multiplayer with seasons, leagues, and a lobby. Cool. New skill, Ice Ward. I have an access point. I said we're going strength. Let's go. Access point. Uh, wait. This didn't level. Sorry. But I got a new skill. A new skill. Okay. Which is here. Ice ward. Creates a protective. I want that. That lasts for 10 seconds of shield. Chills nearby enemies and grants 5 ward per second. But causes your mana to regenerate 20% more slowly. I think that's okay. But this is... Hold on. Fire Shield says that you grant 100 armor and elemental. This one says it chills. I guess we could try them and see which one we like more. Oh, there's the ward. I see the ward at the bottom there. Oh, oh. It's okay if the the regen like is slower because uh I'm not I don't need to use like the what is it? Glacier which costs 80. Glacier is like the big the big spam. Uh, this is an action role-playing game that I'm playing, so it would sim it's similar to um, Diablo style. It has nothing to do with Diablo, it's just on the same genre. That's gonna hurt a lot. No, 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 I want the amulet! I don't want to die until I get the amulet! Okay, we gotta get back. We gotta get back, boys. No! He's gonna blink me. Okay, let's poke him. We need to get ward up for our shield. It's basically like life regen, since we don't have life regen. T1! 
10% crit? Is that flat crit? That's flat. Oh, wait, no, it's not. Wait, is it? Wait, what? Is that just diminishing returns? Oh, it's 5 crit. Wait, what? Didn't it say 10? Am I stupid? I think I'm stupid. It's still flat crit, though. Oh, it's just an inventory bug. That's fine. Wand of Embers. That'd be good for fire damage right now. Do we even have gloves? We don't have gloves. We just found gloves. Oh, that's fire protection. It did say 10. Oh, yeah. No problem. Uh, chance to block 100. Oh, another Shattering Stone. Necromancer Wand. Oh, so Necromancer Wand is the base for minions. Level 9. Oh, we get a new... A lot of stuff. Okay, new skill. New skill. Meteor. Call down a meteor from the sky that deals a large amount of damage upon landing. I'm sorry, Mana Strike, but you're banned. Select the skill. We Okay, we're going to see what we're going to... What we're going to put a point into. And I have another access point. We're going to go here. Okay, what are we checking out? We're gonna check out, what do we use? I don't really use anything except for shields and like nothing else at the moment. So let me see what Meteor would get. More damage against enemies at full health. 15% more damage and less cast speed. What the hell is the cast time on it? Seems pretty fine to me. Um, I'll probably, I might even wait for teleport at level 10 to do an upgrade. Oh wait, I didn't. I can just despecialize. Hold on, let me just test this out. I could despecialize and just like... Uh-oh, why is this stuck here? Wait, what? What? Okay. Um, I think it's... Okay. I, I'm not supposed to drag it. I don't know why I keep dragging it. <laughs> um, increase stun chance per point? I'm gonna wait. I wanna wait and see what teleport does. Fall speed. Dude, they have, like, such smart, like, quality of life thing. Not quality of life. I don't know, how, like, the word to describe it. Teleport doesn't have a tree yet. Oh, that's okay. It'd be too OP. I promise. Maybe we'll we'll look at the shields. We'll look at the defensive shields. <gasps> Next level! <laughs> okay, let's take a look at... Despecialize this. I want to look at Ice Ward, maybe. Ice Ward. Creates a protective shield that lasts for 10 seconds. The shield chills them. Wait. Oh. Grants 15% increased ward retention per point. That's how that's how slow your armor decays, right? Grants block chance. 200 block armor reduces mono regen even further. Grants elemental block. Grants ward on block. That's like... That's awesome. Block chance per point? Subtracts 15% from block chance, grants 10,000 additional block armor, and block elemental protection. Wow. So that's like you build around maximum block chance. Reduces Ice Ward's mono regeneration penalties by 10% per point. Can be cast on allies. Party play voice. Lasts 3 seconds longer per point. Permafrost. I like this one. Cast Frost Nova every three seconds. I might get waves of frost. Because I don't really have much block. I think I'm going to go for this Ice Nova. Let's go. Oh, I guess I could... Hold on. I could look at some other stuff now that I think about it. Let me actually like... Chance to gain five ward per point. Elemental protection... Chains up to one additional target. Increase mana cost per point. Chain. No, we're going to go with shield. I like the shield idea. Oh, but I didn't look at the fire shield. Fireball. Okay, nope. 
Lasts longer per point. Nearby enemies have a chance to be ignited. Can be cast on allies. Elemental protection. We'll just stick with this one. That's gonna kill me. Oh, never mind. I forgot this isn't salt mode. Okay, maybe it is salt mode. Just kidding. Want to buy mana strike? Want to buy mana strike? Want to buy mana strike? It's this fucker right here. Okay, hey, buddy. Hey. Maybe I should have went with, like, the mono regen per as well. Um... <laughs> that guy looks kind of mad! I think I got him. Okay. Six cast speed on gloves and potion refill with dodge? Okay. Hold on, let's get back. How big is this ice nova? Should go boom like right now. Pretty solid to me. Uh, we have another 22 elemental damage and let's get some high pipe. Teleport. All right, let's put teleport. I don't use glacial cascade right now. Sorry, glacial cascade. So is this like the whole screen? If that sapphire ring gives cold damage, I'm gonna be triggered. Please give resist. Fire damage? Oh, I got lucky because it's a blue, boys. <laughs> Even though it's a cold ring. Hmm. AoE's a bit, like, quite a bit bigger than it displays. Honestly, I'm pretty sure I'm doing like a difficult build going like full melee like this. Uh, that guy looks a bit upset. Let's run back. Dude, that, no, that's awesome, actually. And you know what else is awesome? The fact that I just got a 30% increased critical strike chance, 6% cast speed, tome, opposed to my white one. Do lose a little bit of mana, though. And it's time for Arcane Projection! So how, so do I just aim it like this? Hmm. <laughs> Is 
Silver Wand of Stunning. You know I can do this now too? If you get a full inventory, something bad could happen. Okay, well you said blue is like poo-poo tier, so... Wait, the Shattering Stone dropped on my character? It doesn't drop at the units? Health regen, armor, dodge, 3% of damage to mana before health. Okay. Can I tell you through terrain? Uh, well, a lot of terrain you can't actually walk to. So, let's see. You mean like, can I go from like down here to like here? No, if you're line of sighted, I don't... Oh, that worked. As long as you're not like crazy line of sighted, I think it's okay. It's a work in progress, not a feature. Gotcha. That's okay. I'm just calling it anything like unusual that I see, whether it's like not to be like bad or good, but. Grants 50% of your health as ward and grants 100% increased mana efficiency for four seconds. This is really crazy good in my opinion. I'm gonna drop Meteor because I don't need it right now and I'll put Innervate here. And you know what? Innervate is so crazy that. Wait, Static Orb. Is pulls enemies? Okay, but these don't have trees yet, right? Teleport doesn't have a tree. Static orb and innervate don't have trees yet. But I want to. I want at least try the static orb. So what do I like not really use? I guess I don't have to have teleport right now. Or wait, what is number one? Oh, that's innervate. I don't need this right click. And then we have a passive. We're going strength. Another Shattering Stone. Honestly, that stone... This skill, like this ball lightning looking skill right here is like pretty OP. Look. <laughs> That's kind of strong. Oh, I guess the AoE is pretty small at the beginning. I need to get mono regen back. Reduce Ice Ward's mono regeneration penalties by 10% per point. Uh, we could do that. Reduce mono regen per point. Frost only deals 30% more base damage per point. I feel like I'd rather just get Frostbite instead. Since we're already over here. Doesn't do much to range characters. That's what you say now. That's a big boy. Honestly, we're just gonna we're gonna take another point of crit multi. Uh, let me check one thing here.
Okay. Oh, am I stuck? I think I'm getting stunned. That's what it is. Yeah, that's so good because look, this armor slows all, like all the ads, and then it just kills them, so I don't have to waste the mana on it. You can feel it. How thin the barriers of time are here. You can feel how the the threads of fate are pulling you forward, pulling you something into a future. I like that. That was pretty fun. I actually, like, almost died. It was a bit difficult to see, like, the, the monsters. The ones that came out. Oh, do I need to get that waypoint? Hold on. Then before the boss respawn? Okay. I don't know if I'm supposed to click every waypoint. I, I might... Yeah, like, I don't think I got these, unless this is a different area. It's okay. So, I don't really need to use Static Orb, maybe? Like, maybe I'll just put teleport back. Oh, just kidding. I already have teleport. So what did I want to put? Charges an area of ground causing repeated bursts of lightning. Smaller areas within it. You missed a couple. Not super important. Uh, was there loot off that guy or did I not see it? No, that, that skill is really strong. It's just a very mana intensive. His loot was progression. Oh, being able to like go further. I'm going to switch though. I don't want to use charge kappa right now. Time travel started before you picked it up. Lou got nuked, Kappa. It's okay. I don't. I don't mind. Can I go back and fight the boss again? What do I want on right click? I guess I could put Mana Strike on. You can't go back in time. Yeah, dude, you can't get the loot. Not allowed to go back in time, dude. Another new skill, Ice Barrage. Oh, I love skills like that, dude. They create, oh my God. This is like one of my favorite animations of skills in games, dude. Like Ice Lob. Oh, it's a bit difficult to aim though, so I'd have to click like here. Wait, did that? Oh, yeah. Okay, no, that's like 75 per hit, so you like spam it, dude? That's probably like the most mana efficient skill that I have. <laughs> Feels volatile, man. <laughs> I got volatile voice. <laughs> you, got, you gotta stop playing uh, fucking melee caster. <laughs> you gotta remember to kite. <laughs> Ooh. 
Oops. So copper is lightning. Whoa, this helmet gives spell damage. Wait. Hold on. Did I see something wrong again? No, it's the loot stuff again. We'll keep that one. That one's really good. Did they all flick? I didn't pay attention. Did they all flicker strike me or did I like kill them and they respawned on my face? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> the shield popped them. I mean, I didn't need to teleport. I thought I was fine. How did he come back to life? Leather belt, boys. Actually, fuck the leather belt. Oh wait, no. We should we should go back to that one skill. I like I like the. Let's see how much how much does this one cost? This only costs ten, and where is uh. Where's Jelly Ball skill? Ice Barrage cost 23. No! Are there a lot of like on damage mechanics that I'm unaware of? Because I'm pretty sure there are. Like look! He's trying to teleport! I saw that dude. I saw it. <laughs> This is pretty fun, though. It's nice playing in alpha, or like pre-alpha, with monsters that actually like do something. You know, they don't just like... Okay, just kidding, I'm out! Okay, just... I potted. <laughs> I think I dodged one of those or else I would have died. Those guys, 100%, will attack where you can, like hit them from. That's like cast one damage taking home and like homing rocket. <laughs> Those things are so bad. And yeah, so those these guys teleport on damage taken, right? So he teleported and I did too. And those guys just go boom boom. So if I do this, he's gonna teleport here. New skill unlocked? Black hole? Oh god. Oh, oh no 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 I wanna pot and hit this button and hit this. No 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 pot! I'm just kidding! Oh! What? <laughs> Fuck, dude! Fuck! <laughs> They're so mad! <laughs> okay, I think we're gonna go into... We're gonna try the Ice Nova now. And we're gonna go into this one, Lesser Ice Novas. Wait, wait, I have a question. Does Glacial Might only work for Ice Nova, or does it work for the Fire Nova too? Because it says base damage. It doesn't say Ice Nova damage. And guess what? Extra elemental damage? Ice specifically. Okay. I, I assume the ice would be for the ice unless it said, like, augments, you know, etc. to fire. <clears throat> Conflicting voices. I mean, I can check it. It's not... I can, like... Uh, can I see the damage of my spells anywhere? Or would I have to actually, like, smack a guy in the face with it? Correction list. Okay, got it. Got it. I assumed it would work for all just because of the wording, but then again, it would make sense if it was only for one. Alright. Um, uh, okay, there. That's, that's how you fix that bug. Whoa! <laughs> like, what was that? Come on! 
dead now. I even teleported. He like double TP'd. I gotta make sure to keep up this fucking frost ward. That's what I gotta remember to do. Champion returns. Welcome home. Hey, much appreciated, D Chain, for the two month resub. Thanks so much, dude. UTP, ITP, boom, boom. I mean, I'm not playing on the defaulted setting. I am playing on one setting higher. I'm on like veteran. Uh, so if it is a bit too difficult for you, you can always just tone it down. All right, let's do some. Let's do some breaking down. What did it say again? Press F. By the way, I really like that you actually put, like, what is required on here. A lot of games don't do that because if you, like, don't read the tutorial, you kind of get fucked. So I do like the way you kind of integrate it like this. Now, can you figure out what kind of thing you're getting from this or is it just random? Also, this is armor and movement speed with armor, health gain on potion, and dodge rating. Okay. I said I don't need this one here, so we'll just shatter this. When an item is shattered using a shattering stone, it is converted into shards. The amount of shards given is random, but can be as high as one shard for each tier of an affix on an item. This means that a maxed out item with six tier five affixes could yield up to 30 affix shards, five of each type. However, it will be very likely to yield yet less than that. Each shard represents one tier of an affix, and that can be crafted onto an item to upgrade that affix by one tier. These shards are primarily obtained by shattering items. For example, to add a new tier 5 maxed out affix... Wait. For example, to add a new tier 5 maxed out affix to an item, 5 shards of the appropriate... Okay, that makes sense. So if you want to add T5 fire, which for people who play PoE, tier 5 would be equivalent to tier 1, so it's backwards in this game. Um, you would just have to apply it from the basic and build it up. As an item, item's fracture chance increases, the likelihood of causing a fracture and the severity of the potential fracture both increase. Minor fracture, the item is locked and no further changes can be made. Damaging fracture, all affixes are reduced by one to five tiers. If this creates an affix with a tier lower than the one, it is removed. Destructive fracture, all affixes are removed and the item is locked. Okay. Adding shards, every shard upgrade Every shard upgrades its respective affix by one tier. So T1, lightning damage, go to T2. Items can have a maximum of six affixes, and each affix has five tiers. Each time a shard is added to an item, there is a chance to cause a fracture. So that was talking about the one right before. This chance increases as higher tiers of affixes are present on an item. However, affixes that are on an item when it drops out in the world will increase the item's fracture chance less than affixes in tier. So crafting an item from the basic is going to be much more difficult, or at least more difficult than finding a good base and adding on to it. Okay, cool. So let's just start shattering some stuff. Now, is there a, a quicker way for me to, to like affix break this? Can I like shift click or shift right? Will that be in the future, you think? If it's going to be a big thing? Small correction, the maximum of affixes is now four, not six. Okay. Is that limited at, at the moment to two prefixes and two suffixes per? And is the goal is the goal to like constantly be upgrading your gear? Is that how you want this to be? It's not going to be like you have to save this like you want to because it's like not hard to acquire, but it's hard to like master an item, I guess you really want to make sure people are like using them. You're going to make these shards stack. Inventory shift clicking is not in the game yet. Okay. Okay, auto. so like, do I have fire? I have attack speed, I have tenacity. 
Uh, added cold, chance to ignite, chance to poison, fire, melee physical, minion, dodge, lightning, void, dodge. So I don't want any of these right now. Minion, chance to blind. So like, in the future, so there's, I, I feel like there's a lot of things here that I don't want right now, right? Because, uh, like, I'm personally, like, not using minion or any of this protection stuff. Do you think in the future you're gonna add, like, a way to add in like two or three items of the same like three shards and then combine it a random one does that like make sense so you, just so like on the fly you don't have to go back to the bank or like try to deposit it just for like you know ease of access That's a possibility. Okay, that's good to keep stuff like that in mind, I feel. So this is this is the bug that's currently in the game, right? If I click this up, it's not really gonna be 11. Yeah, that's okay. Just on some item text, got it. Yeah, I figure like it like whenever you decide like hotkeys and everything when you're looking at like the shard menu um, You could maybe have like a little tab like down here and like I don't know say for example here and you could have like uh, Click to you know to automatically select a shattering stone uh, click to Automatically combine three of the same kind when I say three of the same kind I mean like there's I see that there's like I don't know red here and green here or you could even you know, you could get more advanced later on, but just like something basic. And then you could put like the little hotkey above it, like or press Alt H or something. Shards also won't take up inventory space and won't be able to forge outside of town. Oh, are they going to have like a separate tab? Okay, that guy's a little upset. I mean, I don't really mind, like, some minor bugs is, like, totally okay. I mean, if you've seen some of the games that we've played in Alpha and stuff, like, <laughs> this is actually really surprising at how, how good this game is. I'm not gonna lie, compared to some other ones I've played, for at least this, you know, the amount of time that you've worked on it. Seems like the lighting is a bit difficult to see here. Like, that skill is nuts. Oh, that's right, I forgot I had black hole. Create a black hole at a target location that summons a powerful black hole at a target location that aggressively pulls enemies and deals high damage. It's cold damage. Oh. I want Arcane Furnace. Oh, dude! I need some Mana Regen, boys! That looked yummy. 14 movement speed? I don't care, I'm sorry. 14. God damn it, I got skamost again. 12% dot? No, I don't care. These are better. <laughs> Always skamost. <laughs> Um, in again. New skill. 
Oh, I have points to- fuck. Oh, they keep- Oh! Wait, they keep getting experience even if you don't put, like, a point into them? That's awesome. That's, like, so cool. Yes! Is that a bug with the lighting? I just noticed it, like... Is that because I'm by this? No, it's probably just a, a bug, maybe. Okay, let's throw this guy in. What even just happened? I think I just saw an ancient tome. What does that ancient tome have on it? Oh, it's just mana. I always fucking die like on death volatiles, dude. I thought I would be tanky. Am I not tanky? And I, you know what it is? It's I, I need elemental resistance, not armor. I'm silly, right? When do I unlock this? I need to. You know what I need to try out? I need to try out fire shield. Can I swap this? Or is it gonna get mad and like yell at me and say like I need to reset it? Yeah. Okay. I, I need fire shield, because this adds elemental protection, and I think that's what I need. Oh! Oh, cool! So I could, like, cast up here and... Feels good, man. I learned my lesson. No! Yeah, I'm aware you can despecialize, but I don't want to do that right now because I like it. Try teleporting up there? Sure, once I kill this thing. How come this thing says fast? Is that I guess that's for its attack speed. Can't you can't teleport up there. Doesn't let me. Put points into the bottom left access to get the node you're going for. The bottom left? I'm gonna look at... I'll look at it again after this. I'm just gonna move away from those things. Oh, whoops. I accidentally just used my black hole. Oh, that's right. I should be using Innervate more. It gives mana regen. Should be like spamming innervate, yeah? Yep. It makes spells cost less. Oh! So it's half mana. Got it. Uh, oh! Oh, that's insane! So that means I- So these are big guys, right? So that means I could do something like- I could do like- 
Okay, just kidding, just kidding. I could do like this, into this, into... That's really cool. Okay. Let's get base damage on Glacial Might. Let's get... Reduced mono regen per point and frost nova deals more base damage. I'm only doing this because I want to get like it, It's like goes both ways because of the reduced mana, which is good that I kind of need and then I mean I can look at mana strike if there's something that makes mana strike ranged I was thinking of Fire Shield, but the problem with Fire Shield is that, I mean, maybe I could use Fire and Ice Shield both. Can I, am I allowed to have multiple shields on? You said I can get the bottom left one. Maybe I was thinking about something different. Oh, why don't I get a point of this? This is pretty good too. I want this one. I'm really close to this one. The fire node. Oh, this, you mean Spellstorm is here? I mean, Spellstorm is good. I think I'm gonna get Arcane Furnace whenever we get fire procs. Yeah. We'll be good. The bottom left, the purple line. Uh, S, click, the purple line. Sorry, am I looking at the wrong thing? Are we talking about special? We're not talking about this. Hold on. Uh, how do I open that again? I'm like... I forgot how to open it. I derped. <laughs> how, do I, how do I look at it again? It's probably over here, actually. Menu, passive grid. Okay. Yeah, no, I, th I'm doing it right. Uh, I'm doing it right, unless, like, I'm not doing it right. I was gonna go Axis of Combat here so that I can unlock Arcane Furnace, and then I have the ability to get Spellstorm whenever I'd like. And I'm good right now. Expand purple line in order to the area to touch to the Arcade Surge. Oh, but I mean, technically, technically, I could keep putting points into access of combat and it would stretch here, wouldn't it? Like this would be quicker, but this one works too. But I guess, yeah, that would, that would make sense. That's why, okay, that's why I didn't understand what you said at first. That makes sense. I feel like there's going to be someone really mad over here. What? Dude, my teleport just said no. Let me try that again. Are you not allowed to teleport from, like, different terrain levels? Or is it because I'm line of sighted?
Um, I'm scared. These guys go boom. Oh, no, they don't. Just kidding. Oh, yeah, that's right. Are we going to use... Um, uh, let's look at fire shield. That's right. We were saying that we might take a look at this. So fire shield, elemental protection per point. And then there's also last longer. So I could get elemental damage and long, like longer lasting. Those are both okay. And then warding? That's actually really good. That's like life regen, but for ward, basically. Okay, so we'll start with... Okay, we'll start... Uh, we'll replace this guy with this guy. Actually, is there a mana regen anywhere on here? So we're gonna go back. I'm actually gonna despecialize from here and go, oops, select a skill and we're gonna go fire shield. Unless, when do you get innervate? Oh, that's right, I can't change innervate. Innervate's too high level. Okay, so then what am I not gonna use? Do I not use black hole maybe? And also, what did we get? Volcanic orb, create a fiery orb that spews burning shrapnel. Let's just see what this looks like. I'm gonna go try. It. I'm gonna go try that out. Hold on. How you doing? That single target, though. That single target is like bonkers. Okay, I found my single target skill. Like, nobody really takes me like 20 minutes to kill those. <laughs> it shotguns in this version, that's been fixed. All feels bad then, I'll remove it. <laughs> okay, let's try Ice Bolt. This one is uh, a lot less lackluster. Oh, it creates a a vortex that lasts. Okay, cool. Already nerfed. Actually, you know what? This one's not bad for single target either because it creates a lasting AOE and a lot of these things are like stationary. Look. See that? <laughs> this guy's a little upset, dude. Why are you so mad, Mr. Sir? Okay, hey, 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 I'm out of pots, buddy. Got him, boys. Okay, let's just like kill this thing. Are 
Are you dead? Okay, it's dead. Oh, no, it's, wait, is there another one? I want to look at my loot, man. Okay. Uh, we got another passive. We actually have one of each point now. Alright, so our goal is to put three points in here. Feels bad. Now we have Arcane Furnace. Well, I mean, it's not really feels bad, but... Um, yeah, we're absolutely taking this. It feels bad because I didn't have to go so deep into this. I could have gotten more deeps out of here. Uh, so that's good. Um, fire, I haven't even like done anything with yet at the moment. Okay, we have... One Agility Sash, which I, like, essentially have already. Heater Shield of the Moose. Wait a second. Teal? Sorry, what is what is the order again of how it goes? Is Teal... It, it goes white, blue, and then what is it again? Is there, like, a, is there a little tier option shower thing down here or no? Blue, teal, green, yellow. Okay, so green and yellow is really all I care about right now. Um. Um. Is there a way for me to turn my camera? Aha! Aha! Got it. I was trying, dude, I, I was hitting, like, insert from Warcraft 3 and seeing if I can do it. And thank you for the zoom in. I want you to know I figured it out at the same time as everybody else. Feels amazing, man. I don't like that guy at all. You need to stop. Yeah, you told me about the transparency fixes. You said you're trying to figure out. So that's, like, part of the reason the casts are kind of weird sometimes. Like, when there's, like, terrain difference. Two intelligence? Alright, if you debate me right now and I pick this up and it says zero intelligence, we're gonna have a problem right now. This is literally cast speed and damage. Aha! We're good, boys. I'm playing a caster with zero intelligence and three strength. Feels fucking amazing, man. That didn't do any damage. Okay, just implicits. Gotcha. Thank you. That's six percent movement speed from that amulet. Hmm. 
No, I've been using Innervate. It has a bit of a cooldown. Omen of Silence. This guy here. That guy was spooky, dude. That was like Sir Spookster. So do these guys not have a good drop table? Or have I just been like walking past the loot? Uh, it does have a cast animation if you look here, look. It's just I do have a bit of cast speed. Um, like not much, but... I... 6, 12, 18% cast speed from agility. I don't know if I have more from other... No, I do. 18, I have 6 here, and then 6 on my boots, or I'm sorry, my offhand, and then somewhere else. But you can you can see, like, if I click it, that's the little bit of an animation. That'll change. Okay, cool. So just no special boss drops at the moment. Totally okay. So we decided we're going to go with the elemental regen build. So we're going to go down into here. Which means that we should try out fire shield instead of this one. Okay, nice, Leroy. Appreciate it, man. Oh, so is this is this where most of the content ends here? Oopsies. Let's click. Thank you for beating the demo. Do you wish to end your journey? No. Okay, what if I said yes? That was fun! That was actually, like, a lot of fun. I'm not gonna lie. If you'd like to support our team in developing Last Epoch, please uh, back us on the Kickstarter, April 17th, 2018. Or you can find it right here. Uh, I actually want to try... I want to try one other character before we're done with this. I guess I'll end the game. Let me see. I want to see what the like other character is like. Um, double click. Play. Level 20. 